Lamar Jackson right now is like Russell Westbrook. They only, we've been talking basketball. Yeah. We're talking about Kevin Durant. Lamar Jackson right now is like Russell Westbrook. We watch Russell Westbrook throughout the regular season and even in the playoffs have these great statistical games, yeah. has this huge impact on yeah. what teams are doing. But you remember when he and Dame Lillard went head to head mm -hmm. and it got emotional. He couldn't make a shot. Right, Everything he was trying to aim every time he was open, it was hitting the back of the iron. It wouldn't go in. And what did Dame Lillard do? At the end of the game, Dame Lillard sidestepped, shot the three, and he hit us with the – Yeah. Right? That's the his watch. Right. That's yeah. the difference right now between Lamar Jackson and Patrick Mahomes. He can do so much, and he did so much last night. And it's almost that you feel bad killing him about those two throws because of, of what he did. Yeah. But that's the position – if I play lockdown defense at the cornerback position the entire game and then I give up a deep ball in the two minute in the two minute drive, I'm wrong. wrong. I've cost Ryan Clark. I do not get why Ryan Clark said something like this about Russell Westbrook also. Because when you make the statement that Lamar Jackson is Russell Westbrook, you're killing two birds with one stone. Or you're disrespecting two guys at once. All right, we all know, you know, who made the most fun of Russell Westbrook during his time on the Lakers, right? That was Skip Bayless. Skip Bayless and even Shannon Sharp, they would go off, they would go crazy, you know, put on clown music and then show all the turnovers that Russell Westbrook would have during an individual game. So coming from an MVP you know, maybe a five to six years before, or prior, you've now turned this triple double machine, something that people had who had valued, something that people had valued so much, into basically a clown show. All right, they called him West Brick. They called him out of his name to the point where his wife had to come and stand up for him. And now, Ryan Clark was usually a stand up guy who usually defends. A lot of people, a lot of brothers who are being disrespected, you know, for no reason. Now he's doing it, and I don't know why. And this is on NFL Network. This is not even on FS1 or ESPN, where you know that they're trying to get the views, they're trying to get the ratings, so they will push the narrative, they'll push the limit, just so that you know the fans can be entertained. And they'll say some stuff that maybe they don't really believe. But to see this on NFL Network, to see somebody with such you know integrity say something like this about Lamar Jackson and about Russell Westbrook, you know, it's really disheartening to me and it's disappointing to me also. You know, because I didn't expect this. All right. Now I was confused, I was stunned, you know, and in dismay. When I saw that pass by Lamar Jackson yesterday, that should have connected and should have gave the team the tie and they would have gone for two. So maybe they would have won, but at least my spread would have won. Okay. If that would have connected, I think it was uh, Isaiah likely, right? This, not the one that he caught, but the previous one that was, was off <laughs> by a tad bit, right? That had me like screaming at TV. Sure, that was an awful pass. Sure, Lamar Jackson should have done better than that. Sure, probably you expect a former MVP just last year to do much better than that. Sure, you expect 9 out of 10 NFL quarterbacks to make a pass like that and connect. But he just didn't make it. Right? He just didn't make it. And it just so happens that Patrick Mahomes is beating him uh, 5 out of the last 6 games including a playoff game last year, it just so happens that, it's, that he has his number. All right? It happens like this in life sometimes. You know, it happens like this in sports sometimes. Somebody just has somebody's number. But you don't got to be comparing him to somebody else who you don't like. That's disrespect. All right? Disrespect to two people at one time. You know, and uh, I, think, I think Ryan Clark is above that. You know, he shouldn't be doing these kind of things. Right, but I just want to show you guys that, and that's about it. So until next time.